I can't stand this anymore. I wish we could just have a normal breakfast like we used to. I feel you, man. It's just not the same anymore. It's also stupid. They get mad at each other for ruining their chances with me, and they don't even consider how I feel in this situation. Love does that to people. Trust me, I know. Mia? Yes, and no. Oh, right. I almost forgot. It's cool. I just don't understand why they felt the need to fight over you. I mean, knowing that someone else likes the same person as you, sure. It's difficult, but it shouldn't tear your friendship apart. That's true. Hopefully, some sort of divine intervention will set them back on track. Morning, guys. Hey, Will. Is Taylor coming to breakfast? No. She's still furious over what happened. I thought so. Maybe one of you should go over and talk to her. I wouldn't go looking for her. Just let her get over her temper tantrum. She'll come eat when she's hungry. Well, she shouldn't be just left alone. Zach, maybe what she needs right now is a little time to herself. Chasing after her right now will only make things worse. Especially when she's this vulnerable. I hate it when you're right. Still, you're her family, Will. At least check on her from time to time. Noted. Actually, speaking of family, I'm required by Cousin Ko to ask you if you want to have dinner with me and Leroy. He wants to cook for everyone. Oh, that sounds cool. If you call being dragged out of a building by people in full hazmat suits fun, his cooking is about as radioactive as a nuclear power plant. Dane, that bad? You have no idea. I guess it's sort of like his personality. It radiates. Stop. Come on, Willy Wonka. I only said that to get a reaction out of you. Stop it right now. It's simple nuclear engineering, Will. That answer should be nuclear. Permission to smack him? Permission granted. No, 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 wait! Ugh, do I have to? Taylin, he is your cousin. If you try to lock yourself in your dorm and eat an entire pint of ice cream, I will drag you out if I have to. But I see him all the time. What difference does it make if I go taste his cooking or whatever? Um, supporting his passion and being a good human in general. Have you ever had Leroy's cooking? No, but even if it's terrible, I'm still going. And you're going too. <sighs> I'll pass. I'd rather not subject myself to that torture. I will fight you. Don't do that. Then go and support your family like a good turtle. Fine! I'll go. I am a good turtle. Great! Leroy will be so happy to hear that. <sighs> I guess. Hey, Raven, I'm going to have some people over and cook for them. Would you want to come and give it a taste? Of course I will. You're the only friend I have that hasn't betrayed me yet. Raven, don't worry. Everything will be fine. Soon this will all be behind us and everything will go back to normal. Easier said than done, Leroy. Even if things go back to normal, it won't be the same. You're right. It won't be the same. It'll be better. Roadblocks are how we grow stronger. <laughs> I guess you're right. <laughs> I can't wait! I'm even gonna make my famous cranberry sauce! Just wait, you'll love it!
All right. We all know how we're going to do this? Right. You, me, and Ryder will arrive at the dorms with Talon first. I have to make sure Finn arrives with Zack a little bit later. If she starts to feel awkward, I stick around her and tell her that we're here to eat Lyra's food, not socialize. I'll stick around with Will, too, just in case things get messy. Then, when Finn arrives, I'll pull him to the side and tell him that he needs to have a private conversation with both Talon and Raven, separately. If he agrees, I'll make sure he speaks with Talon first so that if Raven comes within that interval of time, she won't see them and we'll make sure she stays. And after that, we'll send Finn to talk to Raven, and hopefully things will be resolved. Alright, I guess we're ready. Let's do this. For friendship! For friendship? I'm still preparing the meal, so you can all just relax until I'm finished! I guess we're early? I think so. Weird. The place is empty. Where did everyone go? Probably far away from the atrocities happening in the kitchen. Bummer. <laughs> Wait, what is that? The smell of bad decisions and future regrets. Anyway, Taylin, why don't we go sit down? It's gonna be a while before we can eat, so we can just relax. Sure, maybe we can watch a movie while we wait? Larry Botter? You're on! We're here! Where are you, Leroy? And what's that smell? It's fine! I just had a mishap with the cranberries! Sure, the cranberries are the problem. Hey Finn, mind if I talk to you for a second? Oh, sure, I'll be right over. Listen, we're having everyone over tonight. Everyone? As in, everyone? Everyone, meaning the two girls you've been avoiding. We get you three need some time to figure things out and all, but... We can't all live like this either. We need to get things resolved. Are you sure they even want to see me right now? Finn, please. They both care about you more than you know. I mean... I guess you're right. I'm always right. You gotta stop saying that! I'll stop saying it when it's not true! Right, right. Just... wait here. I'll send Talon in. Okay, thanks. Anytime. Talon, can you come here for a second? You'll thank me later. Rachel, what the heck?! Um, hey, Tay. Well, what are you doing in here? Listen, I just want to talk. Okay, then let's talk. Well, first of all, I'd like to address I had no idea you had those types of feelings for me. I know. 
but it doesn't mean that I think you're weird or wrong or anything. Okay. But I can't say I share the same feelings. <sighs> yeah, I know. You do? I mean, it's pretty obvious to tell. You think of me as a friend, nothing more. Well, yeah, that's true, but I just... Uh, I don't want this to make things awkward between us. I know. Honestly, I don't either. I never even planned on confessing my feelings until the argument, because I didn't want to lose you as a part of my life. R really? Yeah, and if I told you, you might have been weirded out and leave. Plus, I couldn't bring myself to do that to Raven. Not until that fight. Uh, that's my second thing. Even if I did like either of you, I wouldn't ever make a move with you two on those terms. Your friendship is much more important to me than that. Really? J just know... What happened will not change the way I treat you or feel towards you in any way, okay? Just focus on you and Raven. Okay, I will. I'm sorry for what happened. Me too. Oh, <laughs> little Finny, we're all hopeless. Got that right. <laughs> well, I'm gonna head back out with the others. All right. Just answer me one thing. Sure, anything. Do you like her? Raven, I mean. I... I kinda do. Well, I wish you the best in whatever you decide to do. Thanks. Rachel, let me out! Is friendship back in order? Yes! Splendid! Before you say anything, I just want to talk. What is there to talk about, Finn? I mean... things, you know? You don't like me, and I like you. Problem is, Talon also likes you. I don't know what's to discuss. That's the thing, Raven. Not everything you just said is true. Just... can we talk? Fine. Here's the thing. The fight you guys had was because of me. I felt responsible for your friendship falling apart in front of my eyes. I felt like the only way I could salvage it was by taking away that reason. So I said I didn't like either of you. But, I lied. Wait, are you serious? Yeah, and I never thought I would be in this situation, but I- You like her. I get it. It's fine. I mean, she's literally amazing in every way. Why wouldn't you? I'm- It all makes sense- Raven, I like you! I like you, okay? But I won't act on those feelings until you and Talon fix things. 
Your friendship is much more important than how I feel right now. Just... Please, take your time and get your best friend back. My feelings aren't going anywhere. Uh, alright. Just promise me something. Next time, don't give up hope on all of us so quickly, okay? Okay, when will we talk about this again? When I think you're ready. Okay. Fair. And I'm sorry I hurt your feelings. I didn't want that. It's okay. It's better it went down this way, even though it was awful. Good. Now, let's eat some of Leroy's poison, shall we? We shall. <laughs> <laughs>